I hurt my family very bad and I decided to move out on the streets. I felt like I was a burden on them and I didn't know they loved me. And I just disappeared for a, a while and just became rock bottom. It's your sister, it's Margie. Okay, I'll be fine. <laughs> if it wasn't for intervention, I would be dead. I realized that I was a far from good father, and for that I sincerely apologize. In spite of me, you've developed into a person who is loved by all of us in our family. Please accept the help that's offered to you. We'll all be so proud of you for doing this and rejoice to have you back. I love you. With my father, he passed away when I was in treatment. I was with him when he died. He, he was happy to see me. He said he was proud of me. And I'm doing this for myself. And, and I want to gain respect for my family again. I've been sober for 121 days. I got my chip yesterday at AA meeting. And it feels wonderful, it feels great. The way my mind is set, I'm, I'm determined to do what I have to because I have a lot of people looking for me and a lot of people love me this place. I have a lot of new brothers and sisters here. They're all behind me. Everyone's in the same boat. We look out for each other. We take care of each other. We share with each other. It's just a wonderful thing. I'm healthy. I'm more aware. And my perception's gotten back. My health is 100% better. The hardest part about being sober is wondering what's going to happen. I have to change people, places, and things. I have to just face the world like I haven't before. You gotta get help. Even if you think nobody wants to help you, there's help out there for everybody.